hey guys so for today's video i am like really really hyped up and that's because i am reviewing the jaclyn hill liquid lipstick this is like her mystery box that she released for valentine's day i shared this in my whole video i'll leave it linked here so if you guys want to check it out but this has four lip products in here from jaclyn cosmetics yes madam jaclyn hill herself and i honestly can't wait to try all of them so if you want to see them swatched and what i think about the formula then keep on watching i feel so weird <laughs> just wearing this full face of makeup and like bare lips so we need to dive into this box now but for those of you who don't know jaclyn cosmetics did release some mystery makeup boxes for valentine's and she had like a whole collection but it was in my cart it got sold out i told the whole story in my whole video but yeah i'm not gonna go through that depression again it's too triggering but basically all i got was the liquid lipstick set so she did promise we're gonna see more from jacqueline cosmetics this year and i am honestly really hyped for it because i am so proud of jacqueline for the way she came back and really just as a businesswoman how she handles certain things i did purchase every product <laughs> from her highlighter collection that she launched for holiday 2019 and i am absolutely in love with them like i even use the flare palette today on my face so it's just i mean look at this glow it's handmade and i think it's baked in italy or something like that it's just something really fancy of course it's jacqueline it's extra but overall i was like really excited i was kind of confused like she didn't release anything for 2020 and you know it was due to the c word you know that whole pandemic so before i keep rambling let me jump straight into this box so this box did retail for 25 us dollars and you got four lip products so there are three liquid lipsticks and one gloss so this is what the actual unit carton that the lipsticks come in is this really cool red and black ombre effect with the jacqueline logo and it's like kind of embossed so i thought i thought that was a really nice touch to it however while this does look like oh my god it's gonna have like an expensive lipstick inside i will admit that the actual packaging of the liquid lipstick although it's very heavy like heavier than my colourpop ones for sure i do get colourpop vibes from it <laughs> so i'm not the biggest fan of the packaging of the liquid lipstick like it's really pretty don't get me wrong but i don't know when i picture jaclyn hill i think a very extra very bougie and this is like really simple but to be fair this four pack of lipsticks was 25 us dollars you break that down that's just a little over six us dollars so honestly for the price this is really really gorgeous it's gorgeous don't get me wrong i just would never associate this with jacqueline hill i mean just for reference this was her original lipstick launch i mean look at this packaging <laughs> hello but again this was 18 us a piece so i mean 18 us 6 us i can definitely see the price difference but again when you see this you think of jacqueline when you see this i personally don't the lip gloss packaging has to be my favorite of this entire set look at this packaging this is definitely more aesthetically pleasing in my opinion it's definitely more my vibe like i love this i wish i had so many more colors of this lip gloss just so i can display them y'all know i'm obsessed with displaying my makeup but this is gorgeous packaging also very heavy does not feel cheap so i'm really excited to dive into these lipsticks so I think I want to start with the gloss first and that's because you know it's a clear base it'll just be easier to wipe away so you're hearing this that is really in there so did I touch my nose again boy again I'm tired of this stripper this time you know anyway it is what it is <laughs> so it smells minty and sweet at the same time it smells like 
almost like a york peppermint party but not so minty at the same time but it does smell really nice that is cute 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 but again it's just a clear glass with some gold gutter <laughs> so this is stardust on my lips feels nice it's not sticky it's not too oily either it's kind of reminded me of Fenty's formula just a little bit but not as thick like if you thin down Fenty's formula a little bit I'm getting that vibe it's very comfortable I like it cute so I'm just wiping away this gloss and we seem to have some glitter remnants going on but as expected <laughs> now for the liquid lipstick i want to go in with clingy first which is the fiery orange red so this is what the applicator looks like it looks like it kind of has like a cup i don't know if you could see that little dent on the wand so that it can really cup your lips doesn't really smell like anything except liquid whoa it smells like liquid lipstick but hot damn okay this is honestly like a statement color i would wear this and probably just black winged eyeliner and that's it because the focus is on the lips clearly but the formula is like really nice i haven't dipped back yet and i am getting full coverage Probably should I use a lip liner? Oh, I can just not talk and do my damn lip. So that was one dip, and look at this payoff. I mean, that is really pretty. And it's not as orange as I expected. I mean, you can. Okay, so this is one layer complete with that one dip you all saw me went in, and that. It's like full coverage, full color payoff. I definitely should have used a lip liner, but this is really pretty. Definitely, I was correct. It is on the orangey side, so it's like an orange red. I'm sorry for the dogs back in, that's my neighbor's dog. But anyway, I really like this color. Like, this is so fire, and I really would not reach for these, and I have not reached for a color like this in a very long time, but it feels so comfortable i honestly feel like i have nothing on my lips this is like a very thin formula it's very lightweight and it looks so pretty so let's move on to the next color this is the real headache here how is this gonna wipe away because you'll know these long wearing liquid lipsticks how it could go i do have to use a little force <laughs> I need to get some lip balm because that was a lot clearly you can see i didn't get all off i mean 99 percent of it but i'm really trying not to disturb the foundation because i am doing a foundation weight test which should have been up on my channel already but yo that is <laughs> i can tell definitely that is going to be a long wearing lipstick but i need to put on some lip balm oh by the way this is the huda beauty silk balm Oh. I need that hydration <laughs> that is a long ass wearing lipstick it took forever to come off so the next shade I'm going in with is called committed this is like that blue tone red I was talking about earlier okay I knew I would love this from the moment I saw it and I was right this is gorgeous and honestly on the packaging it describes the lipstick as long wearing check luxe matte color check and this is like a date night red in fact it describes all of these red liquid lipsticks as date night reds and it's absolutely right this is like the perfect red i would even wear this for christmas it's like so gorgeous it's so flattering I love this red. I think this is like my new favorite red lipstick. 
and I do love the one from Colourpop and I love Sarai um, I think that one was called Ariba that is like I know it sold out but that was like my favorite red liquid lipstick I still have it that is how much I love it but this is definitely giving me that vibe oh this is really really pretty oh my gosh love this definitely committed is a win oh lord this is stress this is a stress honestly that is the best i could do to remove that red lipstick it's too much i'm not trying to rip off my lips at the same time so for the last liquid lipstick this is called boy bye and this color looks so rich oh why did i wipe it off my brain oh i forgot the lip balm i definitely need a lip balm with these lipsticks because they are a matte af oh honestly if i had to describe this one it's like a plum red like you know the plums we get at the market those deep berry plums definitely that is the color i love this this is like so sexy and vampy i love it okay so i definitely am obsessed with this one and i think i'm gonna leave it on because it matches really well with my eyes but i mean boy bye is a vibe and i don't just mean in general this lipstick is fire like can you imagine just wearing this at night out and about whenever that happens again but mm, i love it so hmm, we're coming back for my final thoughts <laughs> so what are my final thoughts on the liquid lipstick set from the jacqueline hill mystery boxes it's a win for me i am so so happy that i got these 425 us dollars that is like a steal of a deal but honestly the formula love it the i don't know it just feels really lightweight and comfortable and i love the pigmentation with just one swipe and the fact that these were like six dollars a piece i mean come on even better <laughs> but i really like them i can't say anything bad about them honestly these didn't really have a fragrance the gloss i will say it is quite basic it's like any clear gloss with some gold shimmer in it but again six us for the packaging and everything definitely definitely worth it but overall i really like it and i can't wait to see what other colors that she comes out with and yeah just really excited to see what jacqueline cosmetics has in store for us so i hope you guys like this video i know it was like really short but i do hope that you guys enjoyed it nonetheless and thank you so much for watching make sure if you are new don't forget to subscribe before you leave and hit that notification bell so you are notified when i upload videos and make sure you are following me over on my instagram because i do upload like swatches and regular posts and reviews over there quicker than on youtube so i do hope to see you guys in my next video take care